everyone, Mr. Merkage here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to count all of your online users within Skype or all of the users' types. So, this could be away, busy, etc. Um, this was actually commented in the comments, and I'm not sure if you meant how many users are in Skype altogether, but the way I understood it was how to count your online users within Skype. So, that's what I'm going to be showing you how to do. Uh, so, what we're going to do is, well, we're sort of running out of space, and this is getting kind of messy so we'll just sort of work here as there's a bit of space if we kind of move this about got a bit of space down here so what we're going to want is just a label now y you could probably have it different colors so online you'd have green uh, or you could even use images um, you know the kind of images like this one uh, but that's up to you I'll just show you with the label uh, so what you want to do is come into the code and inside the form load because that's when we're going to trigger the to count we'll just say count uh, contacts we'll call it and then let's actually go down to the bottom and create that function public uh, sub count users or oh, did I call it contact I've already forgot so inside here, what we want to do is basically, kind of like the mass message, we want to say for each, uh, we'll call it user, as skype for comlib dot user in skype dot friends, and that's basically getting, or letting us do something for each user in your friends list. What we want to say is we want to say if user dot online status is equal to, and here's all the types, we can say online for now then what we want to do is obviously count how many there are we don't want to type to or write to this label each time because that will just get messy what we want to do is we can use an integer so we can come up here and create that we can say dim let's call this online uh, as an integer and by default that will be equal to zero and now each time or for each online user in your contacts we're going to say online is plus equal to one and every time or for every person that's online it will add one so let's say 100 is online that online will now be equal to 100 so now after the for each just where the next ends below here we want to say label 17 um, that's the one I'm using obviously use whatever you're doing dot text is going to be equal to we can say you currently have uh, plus online which is going to hold our numbers so that will be you currently have a hundred and we'll carry on the text users online now the thing is the late the text here is a string and our online is a um, uh, integer so that them two don't combine if we was to launch that now we'd get an error because obviously it's two different types so what we want to do is use convert dot to string and in brackets we'll type online so now that what that's going to do is convert our integer to a string so then we can use it within our full string here and there'll be no errors so that's just for online we can launch it up and have a check so just let this load up So now that's loaded up, uh, we go to where we set it, which is here, and it says you currently have 129 users online. So that's how many online people I have on Skype right now. Um, so that'll be that working, but I will show you how to do the rest, which is pretty straightforward. Each time we can have another one, which we'll call offline as an integer. Again, equal to zero. Uh, we want to just below this end if we just want to say or we could even go within the same one to be fair we can just say else if user dot online status is equal to offline then uh, offline is plus equal to one end if there we go now we can copy and paste that label label 18 dot text is equal to this time you currently 
Um, and again, plus convert dot to string. Oops, convert dot to string. Offline this time. And then plus users this time offline like that now let's check how many offline users we have so you should get the gist of that now I'll show you again you'd create another one for away and add the away integer here and just do the other line uh, so let's go and find that now I currently have 1504 people offline uh, so that's how that works so again like I said you'll do the rest for busy away and all that kind of stuff so that's how you would count how many users you have and what their status is um, you could also like I said at the start put this to green because they're online and so on um, so yeah if you did enjoy the video please be sure to leave a like and a comment and don't forget to comment more ideas just like this video was inspired by um, so yeah that's it pretty much I'll see you next time